Yes, so, so I, I heard this morning that um, Dee Forbes has resigned as uh, DG of um, RTE. Um, I still think, though, that she should come before the Oireachtas Committee. Uh, she's issued a very strong statement. Um, I think people would like to hear her, her side of the story and her version of events, uh, and it's still open to her to attend uh, the committee hearings, um, and I believe she should. You know, you know first of all, I, I'm very disappointed by what we've learned about um, payments at RTE, particularly the way those payments were made. Um, in response to that, the government has initiated a, a thorough review of the governance of RTE, and Mr. Martin will brief Cabinet on that today, and we should have the terms of reference ready uh, within a week or two. Uh, to do an in-depth and thorough governance review uh, will take a few months, um, so we'd rather do it right than do it quickly. Uh, and in the meantime, we're suspending our work uh, on the reform of the TV licence. Um, and indeed, the, the board would only have known about it on, uh, uh, relatively recently, so we need to bear that in mind. Um, and also, we need to make sure we don't throw the baby out with the bathwater here. Um, public service broadcasting is important. Uh, RT, in very many ways, plays a really important role in our society, uh, from Irish language broadcasting, children's programmes, uh, drama, sport, um, good quality news. Uh, and we need to be cognizant of that. Um, if things were done that were wrong, and I believe things were done that were wrong, um, that needs to stop, it needs to change, and people need to be held to account 